Welcome back. This is Lewis Wood, and I'm here now to continue the HTML Emmet demonstration using in VS Code. Now, Emmet is a powerful feature, and it is also available in Notepad++ and other technologies. Now, so far, we, we, we've done it. We've used it for an H1, a div, a, a C-SPAN label, and input field. And then we, uh, well, we did a combo box. Uh, so we got a label instead of a spam with a combo box. Okay. Now let's go ahead and we're going to do just a plain old list item. All right. And I'm going to use Emmet for that. All right. Now that begins with a UL for an unordered list. U to move to an L. Whoops, what happened? Escape, index.html, less br, greater, less all. Home, you, selected, all. Okay, I'm deleting that because I'm not sure what that Blank. did. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start it again. U, L. There we go. I got a UL. Now, usually when you're doing a UL, because you want to target it with your uh, CSS. So, you'll, you may want a class name or an ID. If you're going with JavaScript, you definitely might want an ID, but you can use class names too. So I'll just go ahead and I'll just do, uh, I'll just do an ID. Hash. M Y. My. U N. On. O R D E R E D. Ordered. L I S T. And I use camel punctuation. And I used a hash, so that means ID, and using an, an emmet. Okay, now the next component of a list is a greater than sign. So I'll do a greater than sign because I need an li. That's the next thing. Greater. Now I'm going to do li. Li. Now I can give it a class. Well, you, it, you wouldn't want to give it a, a name. So, I mean, I could also do grouping and all kinds of stuff, but... Uh, we're going to do, I got li. Now the thing is, is uh, for this one, I want three list items right off the bat. So, so I do the asterisk. Star. Three. three. And that basically gives me, it says, I want li, I want three list items. Index.h star i l greater. T greater. L i, I star three blank. Okay. Now I'll do a greater than sign. Greater. Suggest list box. I'll hash my unordered L is greaterly star three greater. One of them. I want to do an anchor. Item, the and let's say I happen to know that every one of these is going to point to some page or somewhere on my domain. So let's just go ahead and let's just go ahead and start it off. So it's got it already there. And then all we have to do is fill it in the rest of the way. Okay. When we get ready, so I'll do a left square bracket. Open bracket, index.html editor, type in text, okay. period. Okay, and then I'll type in H, H sub R, E, F, F equals, equals index.html, quote. Okay, quote. And I'll do H, suggest T, T, P, colon, colon, slash, slash, blindheroes.org. B, L, I, N, D, H, E, R, O, E, S, period, O. R G. There we go. And then of course. Come on. Escape index dot H blank. Closing bracket. Quote. There it is. G. Quote. I always double check. See it's got that quote and it got that closing bracket there. Okay. Closing bracket. Alright. And what I'll quote. do. Closing bracket. Blank. Now these might be special uh, classes, so, because these anchors, I might want to do some special things to them, so I'll go ahead and give them a class. Period. Suggest C. Index.html editor. Type in text. Period. M. Y. L. I. N. K. S. My links. Index.html editor. Type less OID equals quote my unordered L is quote greater. Less BR greater less BR greater. Less OID equals quote my unordered L is quote greater. End. Quote greater less. Quote greater less. My unordered L list. Quote. ID equals. Quote. M. 
Y U N O R D E R E D L I S T quote Greater Blank space space Leslie greater less a graph equals quote HTTP colon slash slash linterose.org quote class equals quote my links quote greater less slash a greater less slash Lee greater. See what all it did for me? Leslie greater less a graph equals quote HTTP colon slash slash linterose.org quote class equals quote my link less slash L greater. Blank. Less slash less 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 now less option value equals quote less slash less br greater less l i d equals quote my less link greater less l i d equals quote yeah like there's all less link less l i d equals quote my unordered l is quote greater see less link greater less half equals quote h d less l i d equals quote my unordered l is quote greater see it's got my order unordered okay less link greater less half equals quote h d p colon slash okay let's go ahead and let's let's get this one done so what i do is i'll go to the end of it end blank and this time I'll do control and hold the left arrow. Lee greater less. Lee greater less slash. A greater less slash less. Hey, all right, there's the less sign. That's the last bit of the less less sign. So I'll go ahead and this is where I'll start and I'll say L I S T list I T I T M space one. one. Okay. And we'll go to the anchor and I'll just say article one, article two, stuff like that. One less item. List a greater a greater slash quote greater less slash a alpha slash less slash Oops. less okay greater yeah. less greater less slash a l greater L. I messed up. List item so one selected. So I always double check your work. Cut. I should have used my rail display. Greater a slash less. That's the less I want. Pasted. One less item list quote great quote greater my links. But I'm just trying to do them with you. Quote. There we go. Okay. So what I did was I put it inside the anchor. Equals. Quote. M. Y. L. Quote greater. My links. Okay. Quote. Class equals. Class equals. Quote. Org. There it is. Quote. G. Quote. Okay. Now it's after the blindheroes.org. Okay. I'm right there. So I, of course, want to do. Slash. Or forward slash. A T T R T I C L E 1. Article 1. Now I'm going to hit the down arrow. Leslie greater less a half equals quote HTTP colon slash slash. Now here I'm just going to go straight to it because I'm going to use my braille display. It's much more accurate and I strongly rec recommend you get one if you don't have one. Uh, it's a good thing to have. Okay. And I'm right now looking for where I got to put it. Mm -hmm. Yep, blindheroes.org. And there's the quote right there. Okay. Now I'm at the quote there for the blindheroes.org. So I'm right now going to do forward slash article two. Slash A R T I C L E one. Whoops, I didn't mean Escape. that. Escape index.he quote two. Okay, and now I'm going to go ahead and go to the less than symbol. Class equals classic my links quote greater less quote greater less less slash a. Yep, slash a alpha greater a slash less greater less. That's the one I want right there. L I S T space list dot I T E M space two two. Less link greater less a half equals quote H D leak leak slash a greater less a greater less a greater less slash quote greater less quote greater less quote greater less my links quote class equals class equals quote org R G quote okay this way you guys can hear instead of me doing it while you were there slash A R T I C L E and three index dot H D M L escape 
Okay. And now I'm going to go ahead and go to the right and find where the A, the less than is. Classic, classic, my like, quote, quote, greater, quote, greater, less, slash, less, slash, A, slash, yep. less. Okay, there we go. And list item three. It's that easy to do. We now have a list item. Let's go take a look at it. Video second day recording, F5. Video second day recording, video second day recording. Now we'll go to here and we'll go down to it. Bullet link list item one. Bullet link list item two. Bullet link list item three. I'm just hitting a letter I and it goes to it. Wrapping to top. Select car calling combo box collapsed. Must yeah, so yeah, I hit C for car for combo box. I'm going to hit E for an edit box. Wrapping to top. Enter something edit. There it is. JAWS does a neat thing. You can wrap around. NVDA doesn't always do it, but uh, you can always just hit a control up and do exactly what I did in the order I did. Otherwise, just do it the other order. <laughs> okay. And No more headings at level one. Video second day recording. And wonderful world of Emmet heading level one. There it Enter is. Something. All right. Now in the next video, uh, it's probably going to be a two-parter. Uh, I'm going to do tables and using Emmet, and it's it's going to be doing two line or uh, uh, subcategorized uh, uh, headings. So in other words, category for that and then multiple items underneath that category columns that is and then another category with multiple items underneath that category and it will have a row heading and a column heading so you'll get a full picture of what's how to do it and i'm going to be using emmet to do it and all the heading tags and everything so our screen readers can hear it and tell us what's there this way you'll know how to do it properly and when you do it yourself or you want to talk to somebody and have them do it you can just point to this video all right that i'm going to be making next all right then uh to the next video i'll see you then